Hello guys! We are going to talk about past tense and that they are past simple, past perfect, past continuous. Let's get started! Okay, our group members Barhabay Alua, Agirim Khadar and uh, me, Lucy Raydana. Present simple tense is used to refer to actions that were complicated in a time period before that present time using the past simple tense. The simple tense is used for actions that started and finished at a specific time in the past. For example, I saw a movie last week. Secondly, the past simple is used to describe several actions in the past. For, for example, I finished my work, uh, walked to the beach and uh, met my friend. Thirdly, the past simple is used to describe process that started and finished in the past in case uh, the process of the action is long or is used by specifying time periods such as whole year or all day for example she lived in italy for five years the last one the past simple can also be used in the sentence that describe uh, past habits for example she often played uh, valuable when she was child structure in affirmative sentences subject plus uh, past simple plus object structure in negative sentence subject plus uh, didn't didn't plus a base form of word plus object questions in the past simple uh, did plus subject plus a base form of verb and the object now we are talking about uh, past tense and uh, actually now we are going to talk about past continuous and uh, the past continuous tense also known as the past progress tense and uh, refers to a continued action uh, or state that was happening at same point in the past. Okay, now I'm going to uh, explain past continuous structure. And the structures are uh, subject and the was, were and the verb ing. And, uh, we use uh, this was uh, with she, he, it. They, uh, we, you. Uh, the past continuous shows us that uh, the action was already in the past progress. And uh, for example, uh, for example, how to say, what uh, were you doing at 5 p.m. yesterday? And uh, yesterday, I was playing with my friends. The sentence have forms, three forms: uh, affirmative, negative, and the question. And uh, for example, we can give an example. Uh, I was studying at 5 p.m. yesterday, and uh, is it is an affirmative sentence. We need to change to negative sentence. And uh, in negative sentence, we just add not, and uh, uh, our sentence I wasn't studying at 5 p.m. yesterday and uh, the sentence we need to change question and the question uh, was I studying at 5 p.m. yesterday We can use the past perfect simple to talk about time up to a certain point in the past. We can use the past perfect to show the order of two past events. The past uh, perfect shows the earlier action, the past simple shows the later action. Uh, okay, let's move on. Uh, now I want to explain uh, past perfect structure. And the uh, past perfect structure is uh, subject plus had plus verb 3 or ed. And uh, I can give you an example. Uh, for example, uh, uh, you had played, and uh, it's affirmative sentence. And uh, we we need to change it to a negative sentence. And it is uh, you hadn't played, and uh, this need to change question form. And uh, it will be uh, had you played, yes.
Thank you for attention, guys. Bye bye.